Hi guys, it's Wiley here with my grandson Ryan. Hello. Join us today for an unboxing. Uh, loot crate. Uh, it's a really heavy loot crate. Um, I'm quite surprised actually that I got this quite quick, which is cool. Um, normally by now everybody else has had theirs and I'm sort of bringing up the rear so I've actually got mine. I don't think I've seen anybody else that's done a um, loot crate unboxing so I'm, I'm pretty chuffed. Okay, so we'll do it mystery style like I always do. And we get a pop straight away. I just spoiled it, didn't it? There we go. So I'm going to get the pop out first because I saw that. Oh, we got the... Ah, oh, yes. I heard about this, actually. Actually, I thought this was in the gaming one. It's a normal loot crate, isn't it? Yeah. Cool. This is, this is a new one. This is a brand new pop. From the new film, Assassin's Creed. There you go. It's Aguilar crouching. And then you've got the others in the set. I mean, these have not even come out yet, which is pretty cool. So we've got Aguilar normally, Maria, Ojeda, and Callum Lynch. See, I don't know how I feel about the fact that it's not Desmond. He doesn't play Desmond. It's some random other person. So I don't know how I feel about that. Um, but we'll get him out of the box and we'll have a look. I mean, it's cool. It's always cool to have a, a loot crate exclusive. You know, bumps the price up. So if I ever sell it, I'll get a bit more money for it. Which is cool. Oh, that looks pretty cool, actually. That looks better out of the box. Yeah, it does look better out of the box. That looks cool. That looks really cool. Look, crouching. Ah, oh, cool. I was going to say, is his hidden blade popped out? This is his blade there. There you go. That's him out of the box. That's a really cool pop, actually. I quite like. I mean, it's. It's. I mean, it's nothing really special. I mean, it's pretty cool. I mean, it's got the hidden blade there. I mean, if I was a big massive... Oh, that's pretty cool on top. I like that. I like the crest. Mm -hmm. It's got the crest on top. I mean, if I was a big Assassin's Creed fan, then I'd be, like, you know, really stoked. You know, don't get me wrong. I like Assassin's Creed. Looks like his finger's been snapped. His finger's been snapped off. Yeah. Okay. I'll have to check over other people's videos. Anyone seen a finger? Yeah. Okay, if anybody else does loot crate, I'll be checking out. Um, check your figure and check to see if it's got all his fingers. <laughs> no, you can't really see. You're not going to see it there because it's, uh, it's exclusive. That's really weird. Why is he's got all his fingers there, but. Okay, you will be able to see it, I think. Maybe because he's crouching down, he broke it. Yeah, he might have done. That's, that's weird, though, isn't it? Yeah. Oh well. Yeah. So check your figure out and see if it's got a if it's got a broken finger. If his fingers come off, if he lost his finger, then I don't know. Okay, the original one. No, you can't tell. Mm, that's weird. So yeah. So if anybody else has had their loot crate, check your figure and see if it's got a, all his fingers. Because mine hasn't. So yeah, like I said, if I was as big and big Assassin's Creed fan, I'd be really stoked. But you know, oh, and that's what I thought of that. Next item, please. I well, would we'll do the T-shirt. I normally do T-shirt last, but we'll do a T-shirt. Ah, oh, cool black T-shirt. What have we got? It's a Star Wars T-shirt. Is it? it looks like. Oh, Mr. Robot. Oh, this is supposed to be quite good, actually. That's a quite a cool shirt. I like that. It's supposed to be a good TV show. I've heard quite a good few things about it. There you go, Mr. Robot T-shirt. I really like that t-shirt, that's pretty cool. I do like the t-shirts from Luke Crate. They're really, really good quality. I don't know how you're going to get this one. Okay, a great difficulty was probably. Yeah. Uh, you're going to be down there. Um, I am recording. You know. Fabulous. Next item. Okay. I'm to... Oh, we got a book. Oh, God. That's what the weight is. What's this? Figure Fantasy, the pop culture photography of Daniel Picard. Never heard of him. Now that's pretty cool, actually. That's pretty good. Sound there, can you grab it for me? Hey, that's pretty good. Uh, that's definitely not the way it is. Yeah, oh, oh, we got a, oh, we got, oh, that's pretty cool. 
Nice. $25, $25 off uh, Sideshow. That's cool. That's cool. Sideshow, sideshow toys are, are awesome. It's yeah, Sideshow um, uh, figures are amazing. Uh, my friend uh, Raymond. Uh, Ramon, Ramon. Raymond, sorry. Yeah, Raymond. Uh, Last Pharaoh, he's got a couple of the uh, Sideshow figures and they're amazing. That's what I've got here then. It looks like basically what it is is he's take, this guy is taking pictures of figures in different positions. Oh, it's pretty cool. That's cool. That's it. That's Simon Pegg's in the forward. <coughs> Looks like he's killed Jason there. <laughs> Which oh, in, in, in real life, Jason would rip it head off. No, no, no. No bother that. Sure. Oh, that, that's a cool. That's cool. That's pretty cool, actually. <laughs> They're weird. What? Oh, the gentleman from Buffy. This is quite cool. Oh, I like That's that. Cool. That's pretty cool. So yeah, it's a, quite a good book actually. Oh, yeah, Luke Cray, another Luke Cray, there, another Luke Cray exclusive. So I'll have a have a good look through that. Oh, good so That's quite cool actually. It's got some really good, really good pictures. Flash. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It's got some really. That's really cool. That's cool. Yeah, I'll have a look at that next item, please. I think that's the book, so I'll leave that. Oh, the pin. Ah, uh, we got an Assassin's Creed pin. Assassin's Creed. Assassin's Creed. Assassin's Creed pin. Hmm, it's a bit generic, to be honest. Revolution, it was called. Uh, it unlocks something epic. I'll find out what that is in the book, but there's the pin. It's a bit meh, to be perfectly honest. I mean, it's Assassin's Creed. You know. I can do that, right? Yeah, it's not, too, it's not. It's not too bad. I mean, if you like Assassin's Creed, then yeah. I mean, it's cool. But like I said, I like Assassin's Creed, but yeah, like you know, I'm not a massive fan. <coughs> Fire, 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 I don't. I, I've never watched this. Firefly Independence Patch. This patch was created using original artwork files from the TV series Firefly. That's pretty cool. See, now the the messed up thing is, I've seen. Serenity, which is sort of after the series, and it was quite good. I enjoyed it, but I haven't seen Firefly, so it's, it's one of them ones that I need to watch. So you got that, and you got the patch. I mean, it's a pretty nice patch. Um, I don't think I'll end up keeping it. I mean, if there's anybody out there that likes Firefly and 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 wants it, <coughs> hit me up, and we'll do a trade for it. That's no problem. Oh, and there's, there's a couple of uh, yeah, there's a couple of friends of mine that. The last thing, yeah. yeah. Um, there's a couple of my friends that actually, you know, like Firefly. So if there's anybody that wants this who didn't get Loot Crate, hit me up. So we got the book, and it was Revolution. So look what we got here then. And the book, <coughs> the box turns into. Looks like it turned into a house. Yeah. So you could put Ag Aguilar on. Yeah. You could turn it inside out. All the boxes turned. So we got, yeah, so we got exclusive Assassin's Creed Aguilar Funko Pop. Aguilar played by Michael Fassbender in Assassin's Creed film, writes, fights against the oppressive Templars and the Assassin and in the 15th century Spain, and now he can fight Tony in your display shelf in the form of the exclusive pop. Take a leap of faith and check out Assassin's Creed in theatre starting December, December 21st or something. What? Is it? Yeah, it's supposed to be. No, December 21st? Mm -hmm. I thought it was the first. Yeah, the first comes out. Maybe that's America. Might be 21st America. So you got Assassin's Creed Keyed again. Assassin's Creed. Assassin's Creed. Yeah. You got Parenthood. So it starts <coughs> off with Adam and Eve. No, I'm watching you know. And Altier. And you got Ezio. You got the uh, family tree there. Like I said, I, 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 I do like the games, but I'm not a massive fan. They're, they're, they're okay. So we've got the Firefly exclusive independence pass. Show the world that you're still flying when you when you aptly apply this exclusive patch based on the original art files made by graphic designer Dylan Haig. Um, yeah, I mean it's cool, but you know, I ain't too bothered. 
we've got Firefly History, so I might give that a read and see what I think. And then we got a really cool t-shirt. I like the t-shirt. The t-shirt's cool. Exclusive Mr. Robot t-shirt. Paylu to join the crusade to take down Evil Corp and the rest of the top 1% of top 1% alongside your fellow vigilante hackers on this tea available exclusive to revolutionaries like you. Ah, there you go. There you go. That's what it turns into. That's quite cool, actually. I do like the fact that the uh, loot crate boxes turn into different things. That's quite cool. Break the code. Hello, friend. There's a powerful group of people out here. They're simply running the world, and we've tasked take the records and expose them. I'm no good at them. Um, Luke Crate DX. If I had the money, I'd get Luke Crate DX because Luke Crate DX, you get some really, really cool stuff in there. You've got Slam Crate, which is the new WWE one. Which again, if I had the money, I'd get that because I'm a big wrestling fan. Yeah, I've got a couple of AJ Styles t-shirts upstairs when he was in TNA. Uh, we got the final, uh, the exclusive figure fantasy hardcover book. In this exclusive hardcover Luto edition, photographer Donna Pickard shows us sideshow collectible figures featuring some of the biggest names in pop culture rebelling against expectations. Yeah, okay. Uh, loot in action, that's basically what people have took pictures of. That's pretty messed up. That, that looks cool. Mm -hmm. Marriage counseling, who's going to marriage count? <laughs> yeah, Stegosaurus and a uh, thing go to marriage council. Mm. Um, top, top loot of 2016. So you got the Deadpool one. You got the X Files one. I missed out on that. The Daredevil one. I missed that. The Deadpool socks. I missed that. Uh, no, I don't have much luck. The Hulk figure. Now, see, this is really funny because this figure here, that Hulk figure there. I can get that in a shop called B&M and it's three ninety nine for the whole figure three ninety nine in B&M. It was a Luke Craig exclusive, so you know I do I do want that Fallout T-shirt. I'm gonna have to try and see if it's on the boot on the thing. So and see you'd like that. Yeah, it was really cool. That was there was Article. two different ones. There's there was that. two different uh, variants. Um, I didn't get any of these. I think Yeah. I got the no, I didn't get any of these actually. I got like, oh, God, I had something. No, I didn't get any of them. all the cool stuff that was there, I never got any of it. That's typical. We got a thing called Colony, a film. Never heard of it. I'll have to have a read of that. Mm -hmm. No, never heard of it. Nope, never heard of it, I'll have to have a look at that. Um I've got a couple bit of different pieces, bits of pieces about it. Here we go. Ah, here we go. This is what you get when you get the pin. So, you get the pin. Oh, and DLC. Enter the Animus with this pin, featuring an emblem of the da -da 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 Brotherhood. This month's DLC is a digital excerpt from the new Assassin's Creed Heresy novel. Heresy novel. So, basically, you get a chapter or something of the new book, which... A little bit now, really. The Mega Crate, which never in a million years would ever win. So we've got a fully customised sandbox 3D printed game character. Exclusive. That's pretty cool. We've got a 4K Ultra Tele. 64 inch. Uh, Xbox One. Mr. Robot. Quantum Mechanics Serenity Cutaway. And then we've got a Mini Mega Crate. Firefly Serenity Crush and a Mr. Robot Max. You know, I'd never in a million years win that. I'd be so cool if I did, but I don't think I've ever seen anybody in the UK win it. Then you got Halo Legends. You got Top Looter Picks of 2016. That's funny. Isn't it? You got a bunny, a bunny with the uh, um, Future Armor ship on its head. That looks pretty cool. And you got a dog with a. Backpack on in the Ghostbusters one, which I sent to Johnny. And there are a couple of looters there. Do I know anyone? No, I don't recognize anyone. Nope. Do you recognize anyone? No. Anybody there? No. So, hello. So, to be honest with you, um, I'm a little bit. I mean, that's, that's pretty cool, and the t-shirt's pretty cool, um, 
The pop, eh, pop's all right. I don't think I'll keep it. I think if, if there's anybody out there that that's a big Assassin's Creed fan, um, and they don't get Loot Crate, and they want to get, they want the pop, and they want to do a trade for trade for it, hit me up in the comments below because I'm willing to do a trade for it because I'm not really bothered. Um, if like I said, if you are a big fan of Assassin's Creed, I'll even chuck in the pin because I ain't gonna, I ain't bothered about that. So, if there's anybody out there that wants the pop, I'll chuck in the pin as well. Um, because I'm not really bothered. And again, if there's somebody out there that is a massive Firefly, Firefly fan, who's into patches and wants this, give me a message, drop me a message, and I will do a trade for whatever. I, you know, I am too bothered about what you send, you know. I, I like doing trades. Um, but to be honest, I mean, I'm a bit underwhelmed, to be honest. I mean, it's my last one. Um, I was hoping to go out with a bang, and I've gone out with a bit of a fizzle. So, you know. I can give you a bang if you want. Yeah, all in all, um, yeah. Let me know what you guys thought in the description, uh, the comments below. Let me know what you thought of your favourite thing. What did you do with the pop? What are you doing? Probably over there. Looks like Ben's run off with the pop, little little shit. Here we go. Ah, there we go. Cool. So yeah, so if anybody wants this, it's a loot crate exclusive in the box. Okay. Box is mint at the moment. Not for long. So if there's anybody that wants this, hit me up and we can do a trade. Um, it'll most probably be after Christmas now because obviously. You know, Christmas is literally around the corner. Um, so yeah, um, thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm hoping that my BAM box will turn up because I have seen that it has turned up with a couple of people. So I'm hoping that will turn up soon, like this did. I mean, I'm really surprised it turned up as quick as it did. I didn't even know it was here. So I'm really surprised that this turned up as quick as it did. Um, I haven't seen anybody, anybody, of my, any of my friends. Um, has done an unboxing for this so like I said like comment and subscribe my grandson's got a channel I will leave his details below if you can go and check his channel out um, he's thinking about starting doing some unboxings in the new year um, he's you know he wants to do a couple of gameplays and stuff like that as well he wants to try and build his channel I'll leave his details below not blue below go and check him out go and check his channel out go and subscribe to him give him some love that'd be awesome um, also check out the video that I did of him playing Resident Evil 7 uh, very funny video oh, nice. bless him he uh, got very scared bless him but he was quite good so yeah if you haven't already seen that go and check it out it's a good it's a good laugh and um, comment below because I like reading the comments and I always get back to you and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, I'm now on 103 subscriptions, which I'm really, really, you know, chuffed about and proud. Um, and thank you for that. And I'll catch you in the next video. Bye for now. See you later.